Well, um, only yesterday I did mention to you that uh, we have a proposal to develop the, our gas industrialization policy around the Uguta Lake and the Orange River. And that the, the main obstacle of entering the program is the non accessibility to the area. So the government of the state has considered it and proposed to the Nigerian for a partnership to open the assets of uh, Oguta Lake, Orach River, onto the sea in River State. The naval uh, bigger vessels coming to the state. And that will help manage the security situation in the area. Eliminate cases of crude oil uh, stealing, pipeline vandalization, enhance security, stimulate economic activities, create more jobs for our people, and then boost the economy of the state. And the uh, furtherance to that discussion, the leadership of the Nigerian Navy are here. We're going to visit the site tomorrow. Thereafter, we'll be signing the memorandum of understanding leading to the project of the organization. So I think it's a good one for us to stay. And I'm very happy to have this cycle of Is there any time frame for realization of this? It's a work in progress. We will come up with a work program timeline. And when it is ready, we're going to be available. You might want to add a voice to it, sir. Of course, yes. Your Excellency Senator Bofu Zodima, I, I presume the executive governor of the state has said everything, but um, I would like to observe that uh, only recently we established the Navy base at Obuta, which has helped in no small measure to uh, address certain aspects of insecurity in the area. But beyond that, for social economic activities to thrive, especially with the giant strides that have been made by the uh, state. It's only important that uh, being a maritime uh, security agency will also assist the state wherever it is we can to improve on certain aspects of what the state desires to at least elevate what we are seeing as a degeneration of uh, uh, activities within the state. That is just why we are here at the instance of the executive governor and the approval of the chief of naval staff. So in no small measure, we are going to come in to see where we can partner uh, to assist in the expansion of these areas and then uh, letting the state to benefit from its enormous uh, resources. What you have there is not small. And if we are able to open up that axis, I'm sure the um, most state to be one of the leading states in the activities within this uh, area. So that's just why we're here. The officer here with me is the hydrographer of the Nigerian Navy uh, to look at that general area also to carry out the survey and then we'll be able to chart appropriate uh, areas that we think will be in the cheapest uh, possible manner that we can achieve the mandate of the state. Uh, just to digress a little that uh, we have started uh, the dredging of the River Niger, I mean the survey of the River Niger by the Nigerian Navy Hydrographic Department. We started from Lokoja and we are now at Kuru So uh, once the entire aspect of the survey is done, it will be left for the federal government to do the need to on uh, the expansion of that access. So if you have this corridor also expanded, Definitely, we're expanding so much of the country, and it will be for the betterment of the Thank you. Thank you very much. For the records, are your name? I'm Rear Admiral S.S. Lassa, the Group Managing Director, Chief Executive of the Nigerian Navy Holdings Limited. And here on behalf of the Chief of the Navy. Thank you, sir. The S represents what, sir? Can you pronounce it? Yes, sir. Sileranda. 